It's Imagine That with Hardy Watt. WFMU presents Imagine That. Well, you know what else I like to do to get my imagination stimulated is play dress up. Got my box of hats. And everybody should have a box of costumes and hats. That's what I have right here. Now, when an oyster makes a pearl, that starts with something like a grain of sand that gets into the oyster. It's an irritant, and the irritant forms the pearl. So I would like to irritate you now. So oh, it's like almost like you're a prop comedian. Oh, wow, that's what's wrong with that? What's wrong with that if people make us, make us laugh or something, or try to make us laugh and then don't, and so we laugh at them. Still, win-win. Well, I love this hat. This reminds me when I was a kid, we put on a hat like this and pretend I'm a 19th century mortician. Oh, uh, bury you today, governor? And see, lots of people would bury, bury governors in the past like that. They come into my beautiful hearse. You can't see it because you're dead and everything. And I had a long black ribbon here to know that I'm a mortician. And I don't know if they embalmed people back in the day. Uh, but they, they dress them up in their best suits and maybe put makeup on and makeup was made from crushed berries because they didn't have, uh, didn't have like Mary Kay or something. And so if you see those pink Cadillacs pull up to the funeral home, that's what's going on. They're delivering makeup uh, to, the, to the beautiful dead people. Oh, what's this one? This one, this one reminds me of Richard B. Shule as Fast Eddie DeNova in the Great Blue Lake Land and Development Company episode of Rockford Files, season two, episode six. Look at, hey, Rockford, let's fool them. I remember meeting you in prison, Rockford, and now you need me to do, uh, be a confidence man, but for good, possibly. And that's what I want to do is be a confidence man for you. I want to give you confidence in your imagination and your creativity. And that's what you need. Sometimes all we need is somebody to believe in us. We need some confidence. So why not get fast Eddie DeNova to come and give us a little confidence with his hat? Oh, what's this one? Oh, this is my favorite one. I used to do this when I was a little kid too. We'd dress up and say, I'm a Japanese movie director. Oh, am, I, am I Kurosawa or Ozu? Kurosawa, Ozu. Kurosawa, Ozu. I'm going to go back and forth like that so many times. So you go, oh, say, Ozu, Kurosawa. Like that. That's what we do. And all the kids would laugh in our neighborhood. A lot of the kids would play war. I would say, no, I want to play Tokyo Story. So we'd dress up in our kimonos and sit wistfully on a seawall, looking out and going, hmm, this is nice, right? Yes. This is one of my favorite hats. I like this one. This is how to say, hey, I'm selling turquoise jewelry at the Georgia 400 flea market. Would you like some? And I got, I got weapons in the back. So if you need anything like, I got nunchucks, it's a nunchaku. And I got uh, also lots of, th it's not technically a throwing star, I made them out of tinfoil. Uh, but uh, I like that. I like to uh, pretend I'm other people. Oh, this one's good. I look, this is good for my glasses because here I'm, I, I'm, I'm a junior soprano. I'm junior sample soprano. Oh, Jersey City, salute. Remember they do that and say, hey, I want somebody uh, killed. Who do you want killed? I don't know, Mini Pearl? Golly, I hope not. Oh, don't kill me, Pearl. I hope, thank, thank God she's already dead, so nobody's going to murder her like they did String Bean. What else we got? Oh, kids, we used to do this. Say, oh, I'm, I'm Stravinsky. People don't understand right of spring. Mm, it's not angry. Those are emerging flowers and everything. Those are seeds. Do you ever imagine that you're a seed emerging out of the ground? No. All right. Well, give it a shot sometime. Or imagine that you're a, a, you know, some kind of Russian composer. A lot of times our imagination said, we just played like cowboy and stuff. What? Did you not have access to good hats? 
I think the better hacks you have access to, then the better you can use your imagination. Like I say, you know, it's variety. So try to get something that's unusual, like this one. Oh, you know what this is? This is a real, this is an unusual one. What is that, a baseball hat? Yes. So it's from the team called the House of David. So House of, you might know it uh, from the Buddy Rich tape. It was like, no beards. You look like the House of David. Well, what he's referring, you're blowing clams out there. Arr! So I'm pretending to be Buddy Rich, but uh, House of David was a baseball team back in the day when they thought wisely the baseball itself was not nearly entertaining enough. And so they'd have this team, one of them called House of David, and they'd have long beards. And they'd come out there and they'd play baseball. And you go, hey, House of David, How's of David. Oh, I like this one too. This goes good with the beard. Let's see, I'm one. Who am I? I'm the Bhagwan Sri Rajneesh. Hey, y'all, come join my cult. Uh, it seems like a nice thing. Oh, we're all friendly to one another. Mm, but there's secretly dark undertones. But it's, uh, it's really friendly. Oh, I don't want to scare you. You don't have to join any cult or anything. I'm not going to make you join a cult. I have actually used this one sometimes. I also look like a preemie. A lot of times they'll put hats on them because it'd be very cold. And then they'll also put little gloves, little preemie gloves on so they won't, it's like butchies in their hand. You don't want them to scratch your face because they're brand new and they have preemies come out looking like uh, they have like Lee press on nails. And, uh, and, and it's, oh, it's, you're scratching your face up. I better put on no gloves until you, you learn not to do it. And so, oh, you're hitting yourself. I've never used my hands before. You know, imagination is like that. You say, uh, why does it hurt when I use my imagination? And I quote the matrix and I say, because maybe you've never used it before. Or you're using it too much and there's some chafing. And so let's just why don't we dial it back for a few weeks and I'll give you some cream and then and then your imagination will be all cleared up and also probably the redness will go away. Thank you so much.